What's going on peeps? You know, with all this talk recently about quick charge and you know, all these manufacturers saying you're gonna get like 20 million hours of talk time within 10 minutes of charging, I decided to put this to this test and you know, kind of see how fast these phones actually charge. So before anything, I wanted to make sure that I have at least 120 volts of electricity coming through my outlets to make sure this is a well-balanced test. And I wanted to go ahead and put the 5X against the 6P against the Moto X Pure Edition. So I use all the stock charging bricks that came supplied with the phones along with their charging cables because they all differ to handle that power that they're supplying. And you know, I wasn't really sure what I was gonna get or derive out of this test, but still I wanted to do it and show you guys the results in case it might help at least one of you guys out there so i went ahead and created a little setup over here where i recorded everything all the phones were at zero percent with nothing running in the background and so they were at least as even as possible could be so i listed out the phones over here along with the charging time in 10 minute increments and you will see the percentage of battery that it was charged to after uh, about an hour and a half so if you'll notice over here on the right the moto x pure edition was the first to receive 100 percent battery charged capacity within 80 minutes second place after that was the 5x came in at 87 minutes and third place we had the 6p at 93 minutes but i know i get it you're saying well of course they're going to have different charging times they have different size battery capacities and you're right because the nexus 5x is the smallest of the three at 2700 milliamps the moto x at 3000 and the 6p at 3450 so that makes this test kind of inconclusive so we got to move on to step number two what I did in the second step was, you know, for me, I charge my phones in the morning and I like to have 100% before I leave for the day, but other people might not be interested in that and they're really concerned with how much it charges on the lower end. So over here, I did a zero to 50% charged and then a 50% to 100% charged. And then I also included the overall. And in this graph over here, we're gonna see um, the Nexus 5X charged the fastest on the lower end at 20 minutes to reach 50% capacity. The 6P was the fastest from 50 to 100, and the Moto X on the whole was fastest from zero to 100 in general. Now I took it a step further and divided the capacity of the battery by that you know number of minutes to give you that efficiency or the rate of the charging. And I think this is the most useful of all the little tests that I've done over here because if we look over here, you can actually see how many milliamps per minute your phone or your device is being charged. Now, if you're somebody who usually charges their phone on the lower end, the 5X will be the best for you since it has a 67.5 milliamp per minute charging rating, which is quicker than the other two devices. If you're somebody who is really in the mid range, then you're gonna like the Nexus 6P because it has a 29.74, slightly faster than the rest. But if you're somebody who, you know, like me, uh, actually wants a 100% fully charged battery before you leave the house, uh, just to make sure you're gonna be good for the rest of the day, uh, you're going to want the Moto X Pure because it is the fastest of them all to reach 100%. And the overall rate is the quickest at 37.5, although it's just a little a hair you know, better than the 6P. So if you do enjoy that zero to 100, you can go by this scale, which is the Nexus 5X is third. The Nexus 6P is going to come in at second and the Moto X Pure will be first uh, slightly though, very slightly. Other than that, I mean, the 6P is, you know, with its dose feature and Marshmallow is known to be a boss at its battery life and the usability throughout the day. So that's another thing to consider because the battery life on the 6P is way better than the Moto X Pure Edition. But, you know, that's all I had for now. I just want to share these results with you. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll catch you guys in the next one.